the President of France, Emmanuel Macron, and the Prime Minister of Canada, Justin Trudeau, made statements to commemorate the Holodomor victims. This is reported by European Truth. Never forget the Holodomor. It is an artificial famine, it is a genocide. Ninety years ago, millions of Ukrainians died, Macron said in his ex-con. The French president also added that on this day of remembrance, Russia resorted to another massive air attack on Ukraine. I want to express our full sympathy and support to the people of Ukraine, said Emmanuel Macron. Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau emphasized that the Holodomor was an attempt by the Stalinist regime to break the resistance of Ukrainians, to destroy their identity and desire for independence. The Soviet regime tried to hide the evidence of the Holodomor, and Russia still denies that it was a genocide. Now, as Ukraine continues to defend itself against Russia's barbaric aggression, Ukrainians are once again showing their indomitable and steadfast spirit. Ukraine will be free, Ukraine will be independent, and Canada will continue to support Ukraine as long as necessary, Trudeau said. During the Day of Remembrance on Saturday, many other leaders and ambassadors of European countries made statements. Those who were in Ukraine at that time, including Swiss President Alain Burs and Lithuanian Prime Minister Ingrid Imanait, laid flowers at the memorial to the victims of the Holodomor. Earlier it became known that 55 member states of the United Nations and the delegation of the European Union signed the declaration initiated by Ukraine at the UN on the 90th anniversary of the Holodomor of 1932-1933.